Hello, my name is Hui. Welcome to watch my video. In this short video, we are going to demonstrate how to write a C++ program directly on Linux environment through terminal command mode. Right now, you can see on my screen, I have logged on to the Linux environment through my laptop and uh, I have uh, created a test directory and my home directory and uh, at this moment there's no file under this directory and uh, this is going to be our working directory. In general, as long as uh, your Linux system is up, it is ready to start write C++ program directory. So we are going to use VI to write our program and we are going to use demonstrate how to use the G++ to compile the program. So So we are going to write a program called mytest.cpp. So So the first line is going to be include IO stream the header file. Since this program will be run in directly through command line, so it must be have to be specify a main function. And since this main function's return code is an integer. So we are going to be returned zero. Right now we are trying to print out the hello world. So in this line, the STD C out is a standard output device which has already specified inside this uh, header file. Same thing for this uh, end of line, it also has been specified under this line. So this, this uh, end of line, just uh, put uh, your curse to the next line, change it to the next line after this uh, hello world has been printed. So let's save this program. So you can see we have already created this C++ program. Now let's compile this. So this command means we are going to use G++ as compiler, compile this mytest.cpp and generate output, generate a binary, call my test. It's executable, so let's uh, hit enter. Let's see. So you can see the compiler has uh, completed successfully and uh, our binary executable has already been generated. So to run this binary, we just type my underscore test. So let's see, we have printed hello world here. Now let's go back to see our program in our main function. You know, here we haven't specified any parameter. So this is means this program will not receiving or will ignore all the argument from a command line. So in order let your pro our program is able to receive argument from command line, we have to specify two parameters here. So first the parameter is going to be specified as integer called ARGC and the, 
the value of this EARGC is the total argument we received from command line. And the second parameter is the char pointer, which will point to the each individual argument we received from the command line. So now let's print out these two parameters. So let's say the first parameter is the total argument we received. So we're going to spell as total argument R, this one. So the second, uh, now we're going to try to go into print. For printer each argument, we're going to create a small loop. argument we use a small error to indicate where B we see is this it's number ice argument at the end we're just going to print out the end of line. So now we just try to print the total argument, it's accuracy, and then we print for each small loop, for each argument, number i's argument, it's pick up from IRGVI. So let's uh, Save this and uh, recompile this and let's uh, run this. Wow. So you can see when we're running this binary, we didn't give any argument. But uh, the screen printed that we received one argument, which is the, my test, the name of this executable. So this means if you don't if any argument, the programmer will pass one argument, which is the executable's name. Now let's try to give some argument. Let's try to give four argument called argument one, argument two, argument three, and argument four. So wow, now you can see the total argument is number five. So the zero one is the executable's name and the number one is argument one number two is argument two number three is argument three and number four is argument four so now we have a demonstrate how we can write a c plus plus program on linux environment directly through terminal command model and the run compile and the running on the command line this is a way. Welcome to watch my video. Thanks for watching my video and uh, wish you uh, enjoy it and uh, welcome to give my feedback. Thanks.